Hey guys, welcome back to Click. And today we're doing an unboxing and review of the protective case for the Razer phone by Razer. So this came in my bundle when I ordered my Razer phone. I ordered one of these. Um, not a huge fan of the case, but I needed something for the Razer phone as cases are hard to find. So uh, let's see what's what and I'll give you my impressions at the end, okay? So we've got the protective case for the Razer phone. You've got the Razer um, branding or logo. It says Razer on the side here. Okay. And then on the back here, we've got uh, protection, secure fit, enhanced grip, and lightweight. And just some, uh, I guess, Razer uh, information. So let's get into it. So like anything with Razer that I've, ex I've experienced to date, um, extreme attention to detail when packaging. Uh, the unboxing experience was out of this world. Uh, and similar here, like you've got this thing sitting in this beautiful little uh, foam case. Okay, so you get nothing else. Okay, uh, it just says welcome to the cult of Razer. There you go. So let's throw that to the back. And here's the case. It's just a hard shell pr plastic case, pretty see-through. You can see my fingers. So let me drop it on the phone and then we'll see what's what. Now this is really slippery as you can hear it. Okay, it is matte, but it's it's slippery. I don't think it adds any grip to the case, to the phone itself. The phone itself, you know, you can see it feels almost the same, but this is cold uh, aluminum. This is, this is just plastic. So really, uh, is it any better? <laughs> I beg to differ, really. If you want my honest opinion, should you get it? I don't know. I mean, unless you really, really, really want a slim case. Sorry, guys, just trying to pull the dust out from underneath. So let's drop it in and I'll show you what it looks like. So again, left to right. There we go. And there it is on the phone. As I mentioned before, it does look great. Okay, you maintain the Razer logo, the branding. You get protection for your camera, as well as you do get some lay on table. Okay, there's a lip on the each side of this case. If I can try and capture that for you. There, there, you can see it with my hand. Okay, so let's have a quick walkthrough. So you've got a cutout here for your volume up and down. On the top, you're completely exposed. Okay. And then on this side here, you've got a spot for your uh, power and fingerprint sensor. Okay, and on the bottom you're completely exposed. There. Now on the back obviously you've just got your branding for the logo. So as I mentioned, I think the case is okay, like it's not a problem, but if you're looking for something with a bit of grip, uh, this really isn't the one that's going to do that for you. And you can tell if you look from the back, uh, the edges of the aluminum are exposed. So uh, if you happen to drop this on concrete or anything that's rugged, you do run the risk of uh, scratching or denting your phone. Uh, and I think same goes for the face. I mean, if you drop this outside on the cement, I'm pretty sure you'd damage the screen. Okay. Uh, but I mean, it is protect the actual shell of the phone. So it is something better than nothing, I guess. So it's a starting point. So I'll continue my hunt for some decent cases for this uh, phone and uh, you'll hopefully see them on the channel. If you have questions about this one though, do post them down below. Otherwise, thanks for watching. I'm out. Peace.